Slayer. Let, let's talk about that for one second. Mm. We know the type of band that Slayer is. One of the big four, right? Yeah. Okay. Why Chemical Warfare? Don't make unnecessary journeys. Don't take risks on treacherous roads. And don't swim in the sea. Hey, they say that I'm talking a whole lot of trash. I'm sitting there thinking like, who knew? I know that you've seen us on Rappers React. They're talking about us on YouTube. Hollywood 6, it look like I do magic. Maybe he's practicing voodoo. I'm hearing you're getting a lot of attention. Well, I'm here to say that we do to deliver the rubbish. I'm What's going on, everybody? We're back with another segment of... Rappers free. Smoked up. What up? <laughs> I got some more random trivia for you. Alright. Okay. Um which decade did the Bee Gees release the album Traflager? Traflager? Mm. Is it 1960s, 1970s, or 1980s? The Bee Gees Traflager. I would say 70s. Damn it, you were correct. Yeah, I mean that was the height of disco, so Okay, all right. How about this one? In the TV show The Simpsons, what grade did Edna Crabapple teach? Mm. Was it third grade, fourth grade, or fifth grade? Miss Crabapple. Um, third, fourth, fifth, or sixth, actually. I think it was fourth. That's Bart's teacher, right? Yeah. Wasn't he in fourth grade? You're right again. Let me see if I can get you with one. Let me stop it. All right. I'm pretty sure you're going to get this one. But look, what is the name of the mutant rat who serves as the mentor of Splinter? Exactly. I knew you were going to get that. Splinter. Say it again. I remember uh, in the, the movie, the first movie, when, uh, was it Donatello? When April came and she was like, what's wrong? And he just says, Splinter. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> I love the Teenage Mutant Because they had kidnapped Splinter, the foot did. The foot, oh, the foot soldiers. Yeah. 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 Okay. All right. So, um, so name different types of warfare. Uh, chemical. Put it together. Chemical warfare. You got it, my friend. Right. Guys, before we get started, please do us a big, big favor. Y'all, please hit that thumbs up button. Guys, please subscribe to the channel. And for God's sake, leave us a comment and tell us what to react to next. That's how we get the ideas for these videos. Comes directly from you right down in the comment section and over on patreon and today <clears throat> we have another wonderful suggestion from one of our wonderful patreon members who goes by the name of matt goldsberry matt goldsberry yes shout out to you matt's gold matt goldsberry og trash talker yeah. og patreon member because you are a loyal patreon member and you've sent us over a band that we have grown familiar with mm -hmm. absolutely slayer you got to do it in the Vince McMahon voice. Slayer! Yes. Yeah. You know, Vince came back just to sell the I WWE. I heard about that. Yeah. He came back to do what? He, he took back over as the, what is he, chief CEO, Owner? chief operating, or whatever he is. Uh, the chairman. But, yeah, and uh, Stephanie left, and uh, from what the, uh, I don't know how true it is, but I think they sold it to Saudi Arabia. Really? <laughs> yeah. So what is Triple H now? I guess he's still the, the chief operating officer unless he leaves too. Wow. But yeah. That's crazy. But yeah, this is how me and Smokey talk yep. daily. Oh yeah. But okay. We know Slayer, okay? Mm -hmm. We've we've done quite a few Slayer songs. Yeah. Now, Chemical Warfare. And this happens to be the live version that Matt Goldsberry has sent over. And um I'm just curious about Chemical Warfare. Let, let's talk about that for one second. Mm. We know the type of band that Slayer is. One of the big four, right? Yeah. Okay. Why Chemical Warfare? Um, good question. You would think that would be more along the lines of something uh, Megadeth would I mean, do. I knew you were yeah, going to say they're that. more into that type of stuff, at least. Yeah. So it makes you wonder if it's strictly about war, like Megadeth would do, or if it's just a, an analogy or a metaphor. Hmm. I don't know. Matt Goldsberry on Patreon said, listen, if y'all are going to do this, then mm. you're going to do it live. You gotta do it live. And I'm... Yeah. God dang it, have we ever seen Slayer live? I think that's why he was asking that, <laughs> because we haven't seen him live yet. Man, again, shout out to all the Patreon members. Guys, again, I'll say it once, I'll say it again. If you guys want to support us, the best way to do that is through Patreon. Absolutely. I greatly, greatly appreciate mm -hmm. it. But you think that's just what this song's going to be about? Just chemical warfare? I mean, it could be. Uh, maybe it's a history thing like the uh, the power metal bands like to do or or maybe it's a metaphor 
Smoke though. What up? Let's gonna do it. Let's do it. Uh, well, thank you very much for coming out. I hope you had a good time. And this is Chemical Warfare. Yeah. Slayer. Slayer. Let's get it. Yeah.
about to get a concussion. Yeah. Don't break it. Don't break it. No, don't break it. curious genre right how can you listen to this how can anyone listen to this and not move your head oh you have to it's i don't i don't think there's a person yes yeah <laughs> and that you, you brought that up and actually that has been a topic of conversation amongst the the concussion community is wait a minute did you just say the concussion community oh yeah there is um chris nowinski has been uh been the forefather of that movement to in uh, the study into concussion uh, and cte and such from headbanging well that that's been a topic that has been brought up around those circles is that how much uh how much damage are they doing over the course of a, a career by headbanging because they they think that there probably is some damage being caused by headbanging also i mean i can see it mm -hmm. moving your head like this your your yeah, brain your is sloshing around sloshing around yeah yeah, yeah. That, that'd Damn. be a question for you guys that have been doing it for your whole life. Like, do you notice any side effects from yes. that? Yes. Yeah. That is a great question to all our thrash, black, mm -hmm. dark, death, demon, deathcore yeah. metal fans out there. Do y'all experience headaches or fatigue? And yeah. if you do, then you should take this medication. Side effects might be heart attack, high blood pressure. But no, Death. I'm curious. <laughs> exactly. Seriously, I would like to know, like, how many hardcore thrash metal fans out there like i'm talking you'd have to be hardcore bro to yeah, get that yeah like you'd have like but see the artists are doing it every night they're just out there every God. night i mean dude it literally it it makes me jealous that i don't grow my hair out longer just to swing it like oh this. i know just that'd be my favorite move just, just to, to swing, swing it, it dude. yeah you know who's got one of the best swings i've seen like that uh floor floor yeah she's got a great one yeah. dude <laughs> floor from nightwish dude i got dizzy just from doing that though like now do that for 30 years exactly three yeah. times a week maybe you get used to it over time maybe maybe your equilibrium adjusts <laughs> <laughs> your equilibrium's like just forget it forget it <laughs> exactly. forget it man um matt goldsberry thank you for this one oh absolutely yes we have a headache but yeah. it's fine it's the power <laughs> of patreon my friend 100 yeah Guys, thank y'all so much for letting us check out some more Slayer, especially you, Matt Goldsberry. And guys, let us know what's next by Slayer down in the comment section. And with that being said, my name is Behringer Hollywood 6. Bye. I am Larry Smokey Ramirez Cowan. And we are over and out. Deuces. I want to thank you guys for tuning in to another segment of Rappers React. If you guys want to see another artist that we covered, just click uh, right here. If you want to see the last video did, just click right over here. Thank you so much for spending a little bit of time with us today. Please hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already, and we'll see you on the next one. Deuces.